in the past few years, we've been struggling with drinking water quality issues. From the water crisis in Flint, Michigan, to contamination from aging lead water pipes to reports of traces of pharmaceuticals in the water supply, it's not surprising that more and more people are becoming proactive about the quality of their drink. To address these concerns, some people buy bottled water, while others choose to install under sink water filtration systems. For those who want to cut back on grocery store runs, and who don't want to drop a lot of cash on major kitchen alterations, though, the happy medium is water filter pitchers. If you're just walking down the aisle of your grocery store or Target, chances are that you'll only see pitchers made by the two biggest names in water pitcher filtration, Brita and Purr. Contaminants reduced. For most Brita pitchers, there are two types of filters you can buy, standard and long last. The standard filter primarily removes chlorine and heavy metals like cadmium, mercury, and copper. The long last filter is rated to reduce chlorine, lead, and other heavy metals, and some other emerging contaminants like industrial chemicals and pharmaceuticals. For most per pitchers, there are two types of filters you can buy, standard and lead removal. The standard filter is rated to remove or reduce chlorine, heavy metals, particulates, some industrial pollutants, microbial cysts, some pesticides and herbicides, some pharmaceuticals, and some industrial chemicals. The lead reduction can reduce or remove chlorine, lead, and other heavy metals, particulates, some industrial pollutants, microbial cysts, some pesticides and herbicides, some pharmaceuticals, and some industrial chemicals. While both brands have a basic filter that removes or reduces chlorine and heavy metals, and a more expensive filter that removes lead, the PER filters combats a wider variety of contaminants than the Brita filters. Water taste. During extensive testing, we found that, overall, people prefer the taste of tap water filtered with the Brita standard filter more than that of water filtered with the PER standard filter. Taste test participants described Brita water as most clean, tasted pure, and most neutral. However, the Brita water didn't win in a landslide. The PER water was a close second, and testers commented that it tasted clean and refreshing and had no aftertaste. One other thing to note, while our taste testers preferred the taste of the water filtered with the Brita standard filter, the water filtered with the Brita long glass filter did not rank as highly. On the other hand, while the PER filtered water didn't win the overall taste test, both the PER standard filter and lead reduction filter made water that finished near the top of our taste test rankings. Upfront cost. For both Brita and PER, we tested the most basic pitcher and the pitcher one step up from the most basic pitcher. For Brita, these pitchers were the Everyday 10 Cup Pitcher and the Grand 10 Cup Pitcher, respectively. For Purr, these pitchers were the Classic 11 Cup Pitcher and the Ultimate 11 Cup Pitcher. The two basic pitchers, the Brita Everyday and the Purr Classic, generally cost between $25 and $30, and they both include a standard filter with purchase, so there's no cost difference there. However, there is a cost difference between the more advanced pitchers, the Brita Grand, and the Per Ultimate. The Brita Grand Pitcher has a retail price of anywhere from $25 to $40 and includes a Brita Standard Filter. The Per Ultimate Pitcher retails for $25 to $30 and includes a lead reduction filter, which is the more expensive of the two Per filters we tested. Filter Lifespan As mentioned previously, we tested two filter types for both Brita and Per, the Brita Standard and Long Glass Filters, and the Per Standard and Lead Reduction Filters. The two standard filters both have a lifetime of 40 gallons of water filtered and slash or two months, whichever comes first depending on the usage. Here's where Breeder really shines. The long glass filter, its name implies, has a lifespan of 120 gallons of water filtered and slash or six. The per lead reduction filter actually has a shorter lifespan than its standard filter and only lasts for 30 gallons of water filtered and slash or two months. That's to be expected. To some extent, since the more intense filtration required to get rid of the aforementioned contaminants will require more frequent substitutions to maintain the same high level of water purity. That's what makes the Brita Long Glass Filter such a nice surprise. You get high quality filtration and don't have to swap the filter every couple of months. Pitcher Quality Between the Brita Everyday and Grand Pitchers and the Per Classic and Ultimate Pitchers, we found that, barring a few minor things, there was very little difference in the experience of actually using these pitchers on a day-to-day -day basis. While the Per pitchers had a slightly larger capacity than the Brita pitchers 11 cups vs. 10 cups and were easier to disassemble. The Brita pitchers had more secure lids and felt less top-heavy when the reservoirs were filled with water. 
to see which type of pitcher is better for you and your kitchen situation. We recommend, if possible, trying a pitcher out before buying it so that you can get a feel for its weight, required fridge space, and likelihood to spill. Which brand is the winner? Looking at all of these criteria, Brita comes out on top. Brita surpasses per in overall water taste, filter lifespan, filter replacement cost, and pitcher options. However, the whole point of a water filter pitcher is to actually remove contaminants, and the per filters reduce and remove more chemicals from the water than the Brita pitchers do. If you don't have any strong feelings as to exactly what needs to get filtered out of your tap water, then we recommend one of the many Brita pitchers. If, however, you have specific water contamination concerns like lead, pharmaceuticals, or biological entities, then per water filter pitchers will give you peace of mind. Now it's your turn, which one impresses you the most? Let us know in the comments section below. Also, do share and subscribe to our channel for further video notifications.